In celebration of April being Earth Month, I wanted to call out the sponsor of this video, which is going to be ThreadUp, an online thrifting consignment store. Shopping secondhand is always my first choice when it comes to looking for new clothing for myself. Most of the time I'm able to find more unique pieces at usually a better price than I can find anywhere else. Also the environmental cost and the amount of waste that new clothing production produces also really has been staying at the forefront of my mind. ThreadUp also sent me some eco facts for Earth Month and one that stood out to me was that buying one used item instead of a new item saves enough water to keep your monstera plant happy for 29 years. And considering the amount of water that I personally use to keep my monstera plant watered really puts it into perspective how large of an impact our clothing choices can have on the planet. So I strongly suggest shopping on ThreadUp if you haven't tried it out before. You can get 30% off your first order with the code Audrey plus free shipping. I got a few new things that I wanted to share, so let's get into what they are and how I style them. Rather than doing just a general outfit idea video, I thought it would be interesting to do more of an outfit formula type of video, specifically on how to or how I create outfits out of pieces from my closet and my thought process on how to get the most wear out of those items. First is figuring out what silhouette you prefer. My personal silhouette preferences are oversized tops over everything, crop tops with high-waisted bottoms, and dresses that tuck me in at the waist. I like a lot of leg lengthening looks, tops that cut down my long torso, and outfits that bring a little bit more shape and curve to my body. That's not to say that I won't deviate from these silhouettes from time to time, but these outfit combinations are the ones that I can rely on to always feel comfortable and confident in. Next is choosing go-to pieces, and I picked those few items from ThreadUp to demonstrate how these things fit into my closet. These might change depending on the season, but I'll just be focusing on spring fits and going through the pieces really quickly. I have three cardigans, two oversized and one cropped. This is an oversized green Izod Lacoste cardigan. Estimated retail is $74 with a ThreadUp price of $19.99. It's on the thicker side for colder days, and my favorite detail on this is the embroidered emotional text on the chest. I just feel like this was made for me. The next cardigan is also oversized, but the material is a lot lighter, and the colors are more neutral, but it does have this fun, wavy, checkered pattern to it. The brand is Sanctuary, estimated retail is $119, and I got it for $40.99. Last cardigan is a cropped and fitted style from Guest Collection, estimated retail $89, and I found it for $18.99. Like I said, I have a very long torso, so crop tops like this one are pretty much a staple for me, especially with all my high-waisted bottoms. Two high-waisted mini skirts, one fitted solid black, and the other one patterned and more structured. The solid black skirt is American Apparel, estimated at $36, got it for $12.99. This is such a simple basic that I've been wanting, but for some reason I never picked it up until now. And the other skirt is by JOA Los Angeles. I like the grid pattern, it feels like a more modern version of a plaid. Estimated retail is $54, and this one was $10.99 on the ThreadUp website. Next is a white eyelet dress. I love white dresses, especially in the spring and summer. And this one is by the brand Moon River. Estimated at $95 and purchased for $22.99. Last item I picked up is a pair of high-waisted white pants from Jaying. They're very flowy and breezy, perfect for where I live in California. Estimated price is $143, but I got them for $40.99. Seeing all these pieces together, I wanted to quickly mention sticking to a specific color palette. I do prefer to stick to a lot of neutrals when picking out items to incorporate into my closet, so that's usually anything in the black, white, gray, tan family, along with denim on occasion. If I do choose color, it's usually a shade of green. Again, that doesn't mean I won't deviate from time to time. But staying within the shades of a certain color palette make it really simple for me to put together outfits that I feel put together in. I usually like to have at least a couple of items in my outfit to match, but that's just how I like it. If you're really bold with your colors or like a more mismatched look, then don't listen to me when it comes to colors. Another thing that I wanted to bring up is the power of accessories. For example, I would describe this dress as very charming, cute, almost cottagecore. So my first instinct would probably be to style it with accessories that live in those categories. But a quick change of shoes, a different handbag, maybe a hat or a different hairstyle can make a huge difference when putting a look together. And you don't even need another piece of clothing to pair with it to make it feel like a whole different outfit. I get so much more out of just one piece when I'm open to exploring outside of what I used to perceive as a specific category or style. 
Listing all those things again, silhouette preferences, go-to pieces, color palette, and the power of accessories. I find that using these as guidelines allow me to come up with outfits that I like more quickly, and ever since I pointed these things out to myself, I don't find that I complain about not having anything to wear or not liking what I'm wearing as much as I used to because I know what outfit formulas fit my sense of style when pulling from my wardrobe and trying to find what to wear on a daily basis. If I am in the mood to try something else or buy something new or wear something for a special occasion, I can always rely on recreating these combinations with items of different colors, fabrics, and textures. It's a lot less of a headache trying to find out what to wear when I have a general base to start off with. That is going to be it for this video. Thank you to Thrata for sponsoring and don't forget you can get 30% off your first order plus free shipping with the code Audrey. I'm gonna finish up some editing. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.